Okay, guys. Uh, it's Camp King here again. Okay, we're gonna make a glossy button here for like a web 2.0 or something like that. Go to File, New, and use the default settings for width and height. Then click Advanced Options and make your fill uh, your foreground color. And then click OK. So it'll be black. Now take your Eclipse Select tool and make it like as close to a circle, like a perfect circle as you can. Put it in the middle. Now take your uh, Blend tool or your Gradient tool and click. Uh, Go down and look for a brush to warm up. There. Now stroke down. There. Oh wait, never mind. Sorry. Open up a new layer. Make sure it's transparency. Now stroke down. There. It's got a metallic effect. Now click. Uh, New layer again. Click OK. Now select and uh, shrink it by 8 pixels. And then click OK. There. Just like that. Now make your foreground black and your background whatever color you want. I'll make mine red because that's one of my favorite colors. <laughs> and stroke it down. Whoops. Forgot to change the gradient. Make sh make the gradient a uh, foreground, uh, background, and then stroke down there. There. Now you got the beginning of it. Now make a new layer again. Okay. Now we're gonna put that little uh, gloss effect in there. And take your eclipse tool. And make a circle or an oval at the top or at the side or whatever you want, but I'll put mine at the top. Shrink it so like it's about that much in. Okay, that's good. Now take your uh now I'll make this click default and then switch it with the foreground background color thing. Now take your uh blend tool and make it foreground to transparent. Now stroke down. There. And if it's too dark for you, just change the opacity and tone it down a bit. Uh, that's right there. That's good for me. Now select them. And then there you go. Now you can add text if you want. I'll add text. TGK for the Gimp King. And then close it out. New layer. Selection, select, grow, five pixels. Okay, there's your glossy button effect for you. Well, talk to you guys later. Subscribe, rate, comment, and tell your friends about the game.